How to get a boy to kiss you. It's a problem faced by girls everywhere. How to get the boy you like to kiss you. The good news is that if the two of you have been spending a lot of time together and you know he likes you, he's probably a little nervous and just needs a gentle push in the right direction. All you need to do is play your cards right and send the right signals, and the two of you will be locking lips in no time. Here's how. Be prepared. Prepare your lips. The first step in getting a boy to kiss you is to have utterly kissable, irresistible lips. Nobody want to kiss dry, crack lips so get a good lip balm and apply it frequently for perfectly hydrated lips. Before the actual kissing, you should apply a light layer of lip balm so your lips are smooth and perhaps delicately flavored. You should avoid bright lipsticks and sticky lip glosses however, as these can get messy and even ruin your kiss. For moisturization, petroleum jelly or a lip balm stick will work well. You can also try exfoliating your lips by gently rubbing them with a damp washcloth or toothbrush. This will get them extra smooth. If you have a date plan, try preparing your lips a couple of days in advance. Otherwise you should keep some lip balm in your purse for emergency situations. Dress your best. Always try to look your best around the boy you're hoping to kiss. You'll feel way more confident if your hair looks good or you're wearing your favorite skirt, and confidence is super important when it comes to kissing. Try wearing a top that brings out the color of your eyes, or apply a little mascara to show off your long eyelashes. Just be aware that looking your best doesn't mean you should go over the top. You don't need to wear a ton of makeup and you certainly don't need to wear skimpy clothes. Guys tend to go for girls who are natural and feel comfortable in their own skin, so try to let your natural beauty shine through. Smelling good also helps. If you have a date planned, make sure your hair is freshly washed and apply a little of your favorite perfume though nothing overpowering on your wrists and behind your ears. Have fresh breath. This probably goes without saying, but you should always try your best to have fresh breath whenever there's a chance of kissing. You can do this by brushing your teeth as often as possible, especially after eating. You should also keep a little tin of breath mints in your purse, so you can pop one as soon as things look promising. Don't be afraid to offer him one either. He might take it as a hint, which is exactly what you want. Try carrying a travel-sized toothbrush and toothpaste in your purse if you're planning on grabbing a bite with the boy you like. That way you can pop to the restroom for a quick refresher after eating. If possible, use a little mouthwash as well. You should also try to avoid eating foods with a lot of garlic, anything too spicy or anything that might make you burp not attractive before or during a date. Choose the right location. You want to remember your first kiss with this guy as romantic, right? Then make sure to choose an appropriate location. Large, loud parties in front of all your friends are not a good idea. You'll feel under way more pressure and it'll definitely make things awkward. Instead, try going somewhere private, but not secluded, like a park, the pier or the corner booth in a cafe. You want to be somewhere that you can talk and see each other so he can pick up on all the kiss me signals so a movie theater isnt the best option. If you're already pretty close, you could invite him over to watch a movie together. Just make sure that no parents or siblings are likely to barge in at any moment. Awkward. Relax. You should nt work yourself up about the kiss too much. Of course, it's normal to be nervous, but too many nerves can cause you to act jittery or distracted, which might send him the wrong signals. Kissing should be a fun, enjoyable, natural thing, not complicated or terrifying at all. But if those butterflies are feeling more like carnivorous moths, there are a few last-minute relaxation techniques you can try. Take a few deep breaths. If you feel the panic rising, take several deep breaths, inhaling through your nose and exhaling through your mouth. Focus on the breathing and nothing else and you will immediately feel calmer, as deep breathing is associated with decreased production of anxiety-inducing chemicals like adrenaline and increased production of relaxing and mood-boosting endorphins. Ask yourself, what's the worst that can happen? Really, think about what could possibly go wrong with a simple kiss. Are you afraid that you're not a good kisser? Or that he won't like you anymore if it's bad? Remember that kissing is a natural thing, so it's very unlikely that you'll be bad at it, especially if you like him and he likes you. And even if the kiss isnt so great, if that's enough to turn this guy off an otherwise amazing girl, then he's not worth your time anyway. Laugh. They say laughter is the best medicine, and that goes for nerves too. Laughing will immediately make you feel more relaxed and happy and make the whole situation less awkward. Try cracking a joke even a bad one, making a funny face or whipping out some silly dance moves to break the ice and get both of you laughing. Things will progress much more naturally after that.